when I started sort of making my decision, I remember like going to like Rice's YouTube channel and stuff, like I ended up like watching like videos of O-Week, things like that, and I knew like immediately. It's just, it's just somewhere where I felt like I'd have more of a role, have a chance to make more of a name for myself, and just be surrounded in an environment that's just a lot more conducive for making these the best four years of my life. I haven't regretted that decision since. <laughs> It's the sports and technology intersection is definitely the area where I operate. Whenever, whenever I go home for a break, my dad is always just like telling me, like asking me, like, so your degree is still electrical engineering, right? I just want to make sure, because no one else seems to be able to figure it out either. <laughs> Since I've been involved like a hodgepodge of things, like tech, athletics and sports, business. I think the number one thing that I describe honestly as my time at Rice is the fact that it's allowed me to not be restricted by like what my degree is. None of them, none of them reference an integrated system. I got involved in AlSpark. That was really my first domino to fall as far as my involvement in the world of startups. We got a couple of college kids down at Rice University who think potentially if they have the answer. So let's go down. They're at Rice, Park. you know he's sharp, you know he's smart. And here we go. I've got my own startup, Zeal Solutions. And we're basically developing a sensory sleeve for baseball pitchers to help reduce the risk of injury. What is their offensive rating together? What's their defense rating together? And what's their net rating together? So that's the that's the objective. I teach a class now on basketball analytics. It's really cool just to see like you know like every time you know introduce a new concept or like finish a class session like the students just like you know get wide eyed over like on the realization like just how many different ways there are complexities there are to dissecting or analyzing a concept like rebounding that we may have just taken for granted initially and it's it's been a super cool experience. I know I've always like wanted to try to like teach at some level and so this was like a cool like first step and the basketball analytics class is going super well. What you've got so far is a ranking table, was just a table of data. Just the ability to continue searching out and seeking out the things that you enjoy and turning those passions into something worthwhile. I think that's probably the best way to describe like how Rice has given me the opportunity to do so.